This county is probably one of the most in harvest in the United States, certainly in uh, New Mexico. We have uh, about 30% uh, Hispanic and about 60, 65% Navajo. We're pretty well isolated. The biggest city is Albuquerque. That's about 90, 95 miles away. This is where, where the, the technology really comes in because it breaks the isolation. Open file in browser. Go to our, our internet site, okay, go to our homepage, and there you'll find useful links. What you see in this classroom is, is uh, actually non-traditional. Non what we have here is on three walls, we have three 25-inch monitors, and they're all hooked up to my station, and I've got five computers in here hooked up to the internet, digital cameras, I've got see you, see me, almost anything that a, that a teacher could want. My science project has to do with plants and carbon dioxide. I saw that our kids could compete. I started a scientific paper competition. They have to present the, the, the paper in front of uh, their peers and in front of uh, scientists. I knew that I, I could train the kids uh, to do the scientific work. They're already doing it. There's some coccyde. Yeah, there's some coccyde there. And uh, do you see any, any bacillus? Why don't we capture it? Oh, that, that looks nice. I wanted to put it in my discussion about the bacteria. Oh, okay. It just shows how the increased carbon dioxide levels in the atmosphere get into the soil. Okay. I used three of the pictures to show it. How long ago did you talk to Dr. Johnson? Um, last week, I emailed him to set up a time so I could go do my project. Cuba is such a small town, you can't find a gas chromatograph anywhere there. But I get to come to this university so that I can do my project and it's really a good experience because this is what I'll be doing when I do come well. to college. That's good. This is scientist to science. This is real this is real science that they're conducting. In my other samples, this peak was smaller. And that peak is the ethylene peak. I keep up with the technology and then transfer that and give them the opportunity. The technology becomes transparent, it becomes invisible, and it becomes a way of getting someplace else, doing something, making the product better, and, and having pride in, in, in what you're doing. Jennifer knows a lot more about uh, nitrogen fixation than, than, than I do. My role is not to know everything. I can't. I don't teach that way anyway. Some people say that it, uh, technology is, is, a, is a tool. Well, my students are using it as a tool now, but I, I'm using it as a, a partner in, in teaching them how to, how to learn.